Will you introduce it because I'm awkward? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, welcome back to our playthrough of When the Night Comes. As you've probably guessed, because I'm sure you clicked on this. Uh, my name is Robin, I go by they, them pronouns. And then I have my friend Sarah here. Hi, Who she, her. She, her, yes. And we are finally back. Um, I know it's probably been about a week since we uploaded the last, you're gonna wanna go to load when you go. Um, since we <laughs> uploaded the last <laughs> episode, what? but for us, it's been, I think, two, three weeks since we recorded last. Yeah, it's been a hot minute, but I personally have been watching our episodes back a, a lot, <laughs> so I'm like, good, and you've played this like a million times, so you're also good. Yes, I, yes, the only problem is going to be remembering any of the voices, I'm not. Okay, I remember them all because I've been watching the episodes. Well, they were basically going to change. They were basically all British, except this one was French and this one was um, Shrek. Scottish. The French one I was really into. I appreciate I that. Um, I'm thinking I'm going to change up Ezra's because I think I can do a really bad fake Greek accent now because I've been watching my, my roommates play Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Oh, um, nice. Oh, <laughs> I want to play Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Oh, it's so good. But... Yeah, so of course we are still in the midst of coronavirus, so Whoa! we're dealing with the consequences of that, but um, yes. we'll get started ASAP. Yes, I just want to state for the record before we get started that the last three episodes, our recording goofed up, and Robin so graciously went through, loaded up our old save, and clicked through the game in time with what we were saying, which was poorly. probably a lot of work and really annoying. <laughs> it was, I need you to know that I did it poorly, so I had, I spent so much good. time. good, honestly, it only got, like, there was only a few times where you had to go to the history. I was impressed. I was like, I would have stopped paying well, attention had, hours ago. I edited it a lot. I, I had to do it. more editing. Mm -hmm this past time that I have for the other episodes because I was behind sometimes because I did get to where I was reading on my phone and cl clicking through at the same time. Uh, I was not oh, paying enough funny. attention so that I had to pay that's for that fine. when I was I editing. mean, nobody's here for like our super good quality content. Nobody's even that's here. True. Nobody's here. No one watches this. <laughs> no it's one's fine. here. I'm um, alone. Also, I do want to make a clar clarification. I figured out Chris's pronouns and they are they, them. The, um, uh, the writer? The, the writer Chris, yes. And I know that nice. there are other people that Chris is just like the head writer and stuff. So I'm mm -hmm. sure other people are involved in the writing process. But I, we, when we make jokes, they will probably still be directed about Chris. at Chris about, okay. about the writing. Yeah. Yeah. So um, yeah. <laughs> Lunaris Games, thank you for your patience. Chris, thank you for your patience with the pronouns issue. Okay. Respond to my tweets. Respond to my tweets. No. Respond to my tweets. Ready to go? Uh, yeah, I think we're ready for end of chapter two. So we're starting chapter three. I need y'all to know that Whoa! I think there are 10 chapters, question mark? There might be 12, what? I could be wrong. Oh, so <laughs> we're we're pretty far behind. Like, we will eventually get to the end That's of the game, but it's gonna be a second. Um, so let's go. That's all fine, everything's fine. I'm going. Yeah, oh! This is basically the Christmas episode. <gasps> oh, I'm so happy. I opened my eyes to the incessant sound of fists banging hard on my door. Santa? <laughs> My head is pounding still. My head is pounding still, a fuzzy haze settling over me as I drag myself from the comfort of my bed and attempt to ignore the ache that's made itself at home behind my eyeballs. Yeah, if you'll recall, we have a horrible headache because there was a ghost in our head for a little while. Yes. And his name is James. His name is James, that's what we know. I blink once, twice, and shit. It's dark, I'm gone blind. Surely I slept for more than a few hours. I'm just That's gonna do you. a voice. Um, Hunter Sarah, if you don't open this door in the next five seconds, then you'll have to pay for a new one. Oh, shoot. Devil shit. <laughs> You'd better hope you're dead in a bloody ditch somewhere. I don't. I really should be doing an accent. That. I have just. Re Is there a knocking sound playing when he knocks? Yes. Would they knock? Would they knock? <laughs> then I can hear it. You can hear it this is, time? I heard the knock. I haven't heard hear the, the music, music, but I heard the knock. It's I just not loud enough for I... you. Um, okay. Eventually, I'll, I might be able to edit the... Uh, so I've been basically going to audio MIDI on the mm -hmm. Mac and just like going ham trying to get Soundflower <laughs> to work properly for me. Thank you to the creators of Soundflower. You are really saving my life here. Um, but I have it set up so I can hear the sound, and eventually you might be able to hear it, but so far I haven't been able to set that up properly. 
Eh, that's fine. I just, I, I, it's a revolutionary that I can hear the knocking. I grimace, thinking how that may actually be the preferred option right now. Did I really sleep for a whole day? Gosh. Same, though. That quarantine mood. It really is a quarantine mood. I've been sleeping till- Sleep all day, gang. <laughs> sleep all day, gang. I've been sleeping till like noon to 2 p.m. every day. Yeah. I've been- so Okay, here's the thing, is like, very recently I've woken up at at least like 10. But today, for some reason, like 1.45. <laughs> no idea why, no idea what changed, I went to bed at the same time, it's just like 1.45. And Connor, when you're in for the long- for the long haul with this recording thing, me too. Unless you're getting really tired yeah. already. No. Good, you're at not allowed to be my tired. Death... <laughs> well, at least my death will be at the hands of something other than a ghastly creature, I suppose. They had a really good opportunity to really burn August right there. <laughs> but they, they're like, they're not a ghastly creature. Small victories. I look out of the window and it's most definitely past sundown. I am going to die. R.I.P. <laughs> Lunaris, <laughs> imagine, okay, the, I just put this in context. Imagine, like, IRL, you wake up to your real boss, like, banging on your door. That's horror movie material. Ooh, if my yes. boss, I would die. I would literally, I would like, jump me too, out I would the never window. come out I'm of the kidding. room. Like, I would be <laughs> like, I would legitimately leap out of my window. There's, like, no reason. <laughs> That would scare me to death. Oh my god. Literally goodness. every possible option that you can pick is much more mature than my response would have been. Because I would have just immediately started crying. I would have <laughs> cried too! I would have been like, oh god, what did I do? Did I burn the store down? Did I accidentally kill one of them? Like I would think the like I Oh gosh. Oh. Anyway. There are more people in the street than I've seen the whole time I've been in Lunaris, and they're hanging brightly colored bunting from between the crooked little houses. Wait, since when can I see outside? It was dark. Another knock. Quieter this time. I, I have, have things, things to do. To do. Oh, important, you. <laughs> important things. I can hear you in there, you know? I'm... Listen, <laughs> I think I died. <laughs> I think I died. I think I'm dead. I died and I went to hell. And hell is being woken up every day by August banging on your door, being Waking pissed. up while it's dark outside because you slept all day to August screaming at you for being useless and wasting their time. Oh gosh, this is hell. The thought of opening the door and seeing August ready to tear my head off is less than appealing, especially when I probably look like I've been dragged through a fey nest and left for dead. I gather my wits and shout as cheerily as, cheerily as I can muster, oh god. I'll be down in five minutes! Okay. Ah! A series of incoherent mumbles comes from the other side of the door, followed by a clack of heels as they walk away without much fight. Them heels, though. I have the feeling I'm in a lot of trouble. That iconic. Already six foot Wonderful. tall and still wearing heels. In God, heels. What an icon. The wolf is full to the brim with red-faced patrons, all wearing far fancier outfits than the usual uninteresting garments they tend to sport. I see August scowling in the corner, but I almost don't recognize them out of their uniform. Oh boy, oh, 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 I want to see this. They spot me, and I can almost feel my blood freezing as that ice-cold gaze fixes upon me. Oh! <laughs> Do you like their Sorry, outfit? Sorry, that was... I love it! I love... Okay. On the top to the bottom, let's talk about what we love. Mm -hmm. The blue accents on the pants and shirt and mm -hmm. necklace tie together so wonderfully. Hang on, I gotta get... Okay, I had to get up close to see what that shirt pattern is. Love that. Little, tiny, little fancy diamond things. Love it so much. I love everything I'm seeing here. I like how... Um... Gloves. We got gloves. I'm seeing gloves. They're cool. I like everything I'm seeing I here. I like what I'm seeing aren't here. Aren't they usually wearing gloves, or am I wrong? I'm wrong. They're not usually I wearing gloves. I don't think so. No, they're not usually wearing gloves, because the, on the cover, they're not wearing gloves, and they're wearing their uniform. They... This is the tightest fitting outfit I've seen in my life. <laughs> it's so tight fitting, like Black Widow Who. This is the Black tight fitting Widow like spandex Who. outfit of the year. With that deep v-neck. Don't even... Okay, to be this fair, is... okay. they all, everyone always has a deep v-neck when possible. That's true. This, you can tell, it's not a shirt that, he, that they just left unbuttoned down to the booby. This shirt was made... That's a very deep v-neck. Look at the collar, there's no buttons. That was made like that. Yeah. They saw that and they bought that like that. 
because they're iconic, <laughs> iconic fashions. These are iconic fashions. I forgot that I was in huge trouble. Let's let's get okay. Here, are we back? Line. We're ready. <laughs> We thought we're you were ready, missing. We're ready. <laughs> we thought you were missing. I almost had a search party sent out for you. That's humiliating. Thank you so much for that. Not you, not you, Robin, but the... <laughs> No, I'm always here to humiliate you, you know. Ready for that second hand I mean, embarrassment. I have to pick... there's an obvious choice here. I just spent probably five minutes of my real life talking about how good they look. So, so you're gonna flirt. You look good, flirt. This is this is the worst time on earth to flirt, but I got to. I catch I mean, are you kidding? It's the perfect August. time to flirt. You pick someone who I'm in who huge looks like, trouble, and yes, everybody thought I was that's dead. That's why you do day. it. That's why you do it. You have to flirt when you're in trouble. It works. It works. Throw them off their game. You throw them I don't off their game. Like, you saw that outfit. They obviously put it very well together. You have to just. They did. You, you they can did be this like, I purpose. understand that you're in trouble with me, ch in, that I'm in trouble, but like, pause, time out. I'm calling it. I need to tell you how good you look right now. Okay, time back in. What are you going to tell me? Like. <laughs> and they're so thrown off their game that they're like, uh, see you at work tomorrow and leave. <laughs> and they forget what they were even going to reprimand They forget for. to, get, to get you in trouble. <laughs> I catch myself staring as August impatiently taps their foot, waiting for an apology. They look different, more relaxed, and far more approachable. Okay, okay, approachable. This is good. It certainly doesn't help my growing infatuation with them. Yeah, no, it didn't. You look different. Amazing, actually. <laughs> ah, I hate this, but I love it. Their foot stills. A dark brow raising in what I'm hoping is interest, but it's probably not. <laughs> I do, hmm? Oh shit, it was. Oh fuck. You do? Yeah, dude. Food. I'm trying to think of a gender neutral food. Food. We're gonna call them food. Food. <laughs> That's what I got. Um, I smile, biting my lip to prevent it from growing as wide as I'd like it to. Don't bite your lip. They have eyes. They can see that. That's embarrassing. <laughs> yes, you do. You have impeccable taste, General. I'm the one with impeccable taste, actually, <laughs> because I like you. <laughs> Thank you, Sarah. It's hard to find a decent tailor in these parts, so I... The rest of that sentence is, buy my stuff three sizes too small and just stretch it out. <laughs> Mood. They halt their words, narrowing their gaze. They're like, I know what you're trying to do. Oh, are they blushing? Narrowing their gaze, apparently suddenly suspicious of my curiosity. Flattery will get you nowhere, and certainly not on a day when you've shown yourself up so horribly. Fair enough. I'm really sorry. I didn't do it on purpose. I ha- They raised their hand, silencing me. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to not say it, so I might say it anyway. <laughs> if you had attended this morning's meeting, you would know that tonight is quite an important occasion. I didn't do it on purpose. Now, we don't have much time thanks to your tardiness, so please bear with me while I, while I explain. We are in the middle of a crisis, yes, but the Lunar, the lunar Festival is unavoidable. Yay. Harry thinks that if we postpone or cancel it, the town will erupt into chaos. That hits a little close to home right now. <laughs> because and You know what, Harry is right. <laughs> People Harry's will protest. I mean, People like, will protest they, about not being able to get their fucking haircuts. People will protest. <laughs> like, we closed, like, boring things, you know? We didn't even cancel, like, Christmas. And people are, like, in the streets screaming. I think Harry's got a point. Like, Harry's got a point. He has a point, anyway. we realized. They yeah. need stability more than ever right now, and the last thing we need is more panic. That's true. Lunar Festival? Fun. A festival. While there are horrible murders being committed. Trust me, I know. It's abhorrent to be quite ob um, ugh, to be quite honest. I don't think you think it's abhorrent, because you got all fancy for it. It's a yearly tradition that's been around for centuries, one that Harry holds dear. He's been distant lately. We need we need our leader back, and if this helps, then I'm willing to play along. Willing. You bought that outfit just for today. <laughs> Custom tailored just for today. I expect you to do the oh, same. Yeah. 
no questions asked. Understood? Understand? I hardly agree, and I have more than enough on my mind than I need to figure out, but the look August is giving me tells me I have little to no choice. I ponder their question for a little longer than necessary for dramatic effect, feeling them growing impatient. I am a little twerp. I didn't come to work today. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to tell them why I didn't come to work today. And to be fair, they now didn't give you I a chance. Off, oh, it's true, but I still didn't. Like, 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 they don't know why I was not there. And now, when I'm on the thinnest ice possible, I'm like, let me just be a little jerk for a while. <laughs> and flirt with you. Don't forget that. I've seen you three times in my life. Absolutely anything you need. They relax at that, their pretty eyes bright as they stare me down. Good. Mm. Between you and me, I personally think it's a complete and utter waste of t time and resources, especially in the middle of such a crisis. They sigh heavily, shrugging as if they've already admitted defeat. Alas, it's important to Harry that we stick with said tradition and show the people of Lunaris that everything is exactly as it should be. Yeah. So, just forget about the horrible murderers in my sworn duty to protect and serve the people for a night, then. Long sentence. Yes. You got it. I like how this is, like... I've been jokingly calling them anime boys and <laughs> anime girls and anime people, even though it's not anime, but, like, something huge and plot revolutionary <laughs> happened last time, and now it's, now like, beach episode! Now we get a episode. beach episode! <laughs> <laughs> Like, I've watched all of, like, two animes, and I, even I know oh the Oh my formula. god, two animes. Like, what are the two animes? Huge. What are the two animes? I've watched Free Iwatobi Swim Club, <laughs> and I've watched uh, Yuri on Ice. You know this, this about me, we've been over this. I didn't know that you had watched Free. I knew that you'd watched Yuri on Ice. I have a, I watched the entirety of Free. I've been thinking about rewatching. I it. saw I love four Free. episodes of Free and had no clue what was going on, so I stopped. It takes it a while to kind of get going, but yeah. I'm into it. Anyway. <laughs> and I don't have a choice? Do you ever? Well. <laughs> point taken. A rather loud cheer rings out from the doorway, and August grimaces, running a gloved hand over their face. The festival itself takes place in the market. Please represent us well, Hunter. So, am I just partying? Is that how I'm gonna represent us? All eyes will be on you, and this is the perfect opportunity for you to introduce yourself to the town. Then they look me up and down, apparently unsatisfied with my presentation. I'm so dang sorry that we can't all shop at the 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 the, the, the tall and thin store every single day of our lives. <laughs> You'll want to change into something a little more interesting, and I suggest you find someone to escort you. Oh shoot, am I getting a date? Someone escorted me like I get a date. Also, I've been thinking since I saw their like dope red, red, dope blue outfit that I would love some like customization in this game, but I love character customization in every game. But you so. get to make up what your character looks like. Do I? Yay. Yeah, you never get to see your character. You know this. I know, but I know I don't, but, but I want to know. <laughs> well, that's what you make it yourself. It would look I, I, oh, that's what you mean. Yeah. I, okay. <laughs> you just have to learn how to draw, Sarah. Or use a doll divine. Okay. You, use some... I'll use a doll divine. What I'll do is I'll just import my Fallout 4 save <laughs> and use her. Of course, iconic. It would look a little odd having you wander around by yourself. We have to show solidarity. I'm gonna bring a werewolf. You can't stop. Ah, oh! sorry, sorry. That was... Okay, so here's the thing. Would you? Here's where we have to make decisions, Sarah. Do you? It says want... save here so you can return and play with another. That's what I'm saying. Is are we just going to do one date for this game, or are we going to is come this... back and redo the lunar lunar festival with multiple people? What do you want to do? One trillion times. Is th is this kind of a filler episode right now? It's kind like, of filler, but you get some extra character interactions later. Uh, it doesn't decide who you're going to date. This is just okay. for fun. So, like, you can pick someone for this and completely decide. Like, they'll let you know explicitly when you're picking the route that you're going to be on. Okay, so if I want to play the Lunar Festival, like, one, two, three, four, five, six times, 
it does sort of affect the ending is what you're saying we get special scenes later you get special scenes before you pick your route with whichever person like you don't get like whole new scenes it's just some of the dialogue changes it changes okay, maybe a total of changes. five lines per person okay so okay. would you and either way like only one of them can be canon for the rest of the playthrough you know okay 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 so like what i would like hypothetically i would pick i would play them all and then decide which one was like my favorite and yeah. finish the game with that one yes okay do you want do to that do then. that so this whole episode is going to be lunar festival are you are you yeah. cool with that yeah rock on i'm so cool with that let's do a i save. don't care how long it takes us to play this game save that shit yeah hell okay. yeah sorry I so have are we going how do you want to how do you how do you uh matt mercer voice how how do you want to do this uh how do you want to do this um i kind of want to work in order from most to least favorite okay iconic or or the other way around whichever one i can because you know i'm dying to click this button right here that says find out car you know this about okay me. so here's the thing okay i would advise us to go in the opposite direction so that you don't forget and, and where I want to be. Than where you want to be, because I don't want you to forget. Because I think it's most likely that you'll stick with your favorite character. Yeah. And I don't want you to forget mm -hmm. what happened. The other ones. Okay. I feel kind of bad that, like, this early in a 10 chapter game, I've basically already decided <laughs> that I'm a Catboy fan, but, like. He's not even a Catboy! He won me over, he won me over. I don't know what to tell He you. did win you over. Okay, so who okay, is your so least. Your your least likely least, to date. My least likely to date feels like... Oh, I almost thought Ezra wasn't on this list. Either Piper or Ezra, which is weird because I want to date literally everybody, but it, like if I had to put them in an order... Uh, let's go with Piper. Is Piper also required to attend the festival? I'm gonna go on a date with your sworn enemy. <laughs> They're not she sworn is. enemies! She is, but she's expected to work. Okay, she's been okay. assigned as guard this evening. Are so you, she'll be there, are you is August what now? I'm hearing. Sorry, I wasn't listening. <laughs> I mean, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Sorry. Go for it. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. She is, but she is expected to work. She's been assigned as god this evening. I'm not used to playing well with others. I always forget. I see. They sigh, clearly exasperated that I apparently have an interest in her whereabouts. I know, dude. The food. I know, dude. <laughs> If you are food. going to seek her out, just just see to it that you don't disturb her work. Okay. And don't forget to change. I'll come up with something really cool, okay? Don't worry about me. I nod, smiling politely. Yes, General. Bye, General. Good, Good evening, evening Hunter. Hunter. I'm sorry I did it again. <laughs> Oops, I did it again. <laughs> it's I read all your book. lines. <laughs> I'm they tug on an expensive looking fur coat and head out into the chill. I hate that. I don't know why, but just like I can't wait till you see the coat. coat. Oh gosh, I'm so ready to see the coat. I look down at my outfit, sighing as I resign myself to the fact that I probably should change. Do I get to pick? No, like, you don't get to pick. Darn it! I head out into the snow covered night, taking in the strange beauty of the town Brooms. as I draw nearer to Brooms. the market. Brooms. Brooms. Okay. Brooms. I love all this snow. I love the snow. Looks like soap shavings. <laughs> a lush blanket of white covers the top of the <laughs> little house. A bunch of people, it's not actually soap. Like, a bunch of people just took out, it's... like, cheese graters. and a, or, or, <laughs> It's not It's not snow, it's soap. People took cheese graters and, just, and cheese, just, like... It's an old Lunaris tradition. It's an old Lunaris tradition. They take soap and they just the use the snowing. cheese grate. They just grate the soap. Um... <laughs> It's the great soap grating. It's been a tradition for millennia. You can't the town is the so damn grating. clean. <laughs> no coronavirus here, of... folks. <laughs> <laughs> we always wash our hands and our street and our cheese graters. A lush blanket of soap covers the tops of the crooked little houses, a dusting settling on the cobblestone where it still falls from the sky in a gentle flurry of soap. <laughs> Lunara certainly has charm and soap. <laughs> and when it's quiet like this, it could almost be mistaken for being peaceful. I hear rustling, then a quiet, whispered string of curses. Hey, I know somebody who curses. Oh, wrong wrong one. What's up? <laughs> I... Sarah, would you like to do some voices? I love... I'm 
sorry. I got this. I'm just, I'm... <laughs> I thought it was gonna be Piper because they were swearing. You're just so excited to to move and on. When it was Alcar. I was like, of course it's Alcar. Okay, next one you get it. I promise. Thank you. What are you doing? I'm shocked to see him actually wearing an additional layer, but his feet are still bare. <laughs> Mood. Aren't you cold? I love your hood thing though. That's kind of fun. I'm gonna like him. I'm never cold. I don't know if that's how that works at all. Fair point. I think they run warm He shrugs. Blood. Maybe. He shrugs, rubbing the back of his neck before throwing me a quick wave, turning to leave. Bye! I'm gonna pick your route. Don't you Don't you forget it. Wait, are you going to the festival? Do you want to go out? I picked the wrong route? Yes, unfortunately. Want to walk there together? <sighs> okay. He groans, rolling his eyes. I guess. Keep up, though. We walk in silence, Alcar kicking the snow as we go. Oh, stop, weird. that's so... He's not exactly interesting company, but he is quite fascinating to watch. Eventually he sighs, deciding to strike up some conversation. So, are you just going to wander... To... To... <laughs> so are you just going to wander around all alone? I'm being bullied right now. You are being bullied by the- Because I wanted to pick his route, and he's like, so do you have a date to the thing? And I've got to be like, no, I clicked on Piper because I'm mad now. (laughs) No, I'm going to try to find Piper, actually, but don't worry, there's five other buttons and you're on one of them. (laughs) He makes a disgusted noise, gagging for dramatic effect. I love that about you, that you're gagging. This cracks me up so much, because if you choose Omen's route, yeah, you told me that. I mean, we didn't tell the people he, at home. but We can tell the people at home, I think. Well, should yes. we? I don't know. I think the implication like, is there. Like, I figured out. Like, I've impl- I figured out all the things that we talked you about did. that one time. Like, this cracks me up because, too. like, there's the- it's possible for him and Piper to sleep together. Like, that's nice. so funny, and he's just over here, like, gagging. And he child. hates Piper. That is so funny I don't think he hates me. Piper. I think they just have, like, a vitriolic friendship. Just being dramatic about it. Oh, yes, he's so dramatic. I love that about him. I can't <laughs> help but laugh at his theatrics. No love lost between you two? I know what happens if I pick the omen route. He scoffs. She hates me, I hate her. It's a m- mutual eight fest. Eight fest. Eight fest. At least you'll find her easily if you arrive with me. I'm sure she stuck a tracking dot up my ass when I wasn't looking. Enemies to friends to lovers. Hey, this is a new setting. We reach the edge of the market and I'm taken aback by how colorful it is. Pretty. It's full of life, bursting at the seams. Pretty colors. It's full of life, bursting at the seams with smiling faces and laughter. I don't see any faces, but I'll (laughs) trust me. Well, this is impressive. I see rugs hanging from a pole. That's crazy. <laughs> Alcar, sh- Alcar shrugs, scratching his chin, his eyes darting around. I'm going to go and find Ezra and the idiots before Merrim shows up. Ezra and the idiots, that's the name of the I embarrass myself in front of the new girl <laughs> meeting. Ezra and the idiots. <laughs> it's a band. Oh, continue. Uh, I gotta go find them. Blah blah blah. Click. I can't click. Please let me click. There we go. The idiots. <laughs> the vampire and the demon. Who else? Don't be rude. Don't be rude. Omen's just foreign, and well, the vampire's well, the thing, just. Is I'm pretty sure he's also slept with Finn. Cool. So like the dynamic here is that Alcar's like, am I attracted to you? I'm gonna call you stupid. Fuck you. Like, right. <laughs> I mean, which kind of checks out for that him. That makes sense. What an affectionate way to refer to them. He lets out a sharp, quick laugh, quite pleased with himself. I know. <laughs> anyway, laters. Laters? 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 Why? He, this gone. bitch said laters. He said laters. Like, that's- okay, when they have the next meeting. He's like, I can't believe <laughs> I said fucking laters to the new girl. <laughs> what am I, 12? <laughs> <laughs> like, and, and Finn's just like, we've been new, dude. Like, 